Hello everyone and welcome to Selly Nation Week 1. Today's matchup is the Gators against the Brown Bandits. The Gators are presented by Home Girls Real Estate. And the Brown Bandits are presented by Downtown Diner in beautiful Celebration, Florida. I'm Commissioner Ash. This is Coach Tone Antonio of the La Familia. Coming off a big win in Game 1. Very exciting. We had to see the debut of the Brown Brown Bandits, Noah's team, and then the, the Green Green Gators. <laughs> Uh, number one pick, number one pick, uh, Chili. Uh, we didn't have him last year. We're happy to have him this year. He's the man. You got any words for us? Yeah, uh, stay locked in. Stay locked in, Brown Brown Bandits. You heard it first. Captain, how are you feeling? Feeling great about the whole situation. It should be a, uh, you're blocking my shot. You're there, blocking but... my shot. This is not about you. This is about me. Hey, are you kidding me? I'm captain. <laughs> you're captain. <laughs> I'm co-commissioner. <laughs> um, Braylon Pickens, number one right there. He's probably going to be the best player on the floor talent-wise, but let's see if he's motivated enough to play. Like Johnny Victor last year, he probably was the most talented player last year. He just didn't show enough um, want to win. And the Gators are just going to go do Gator, man. They're just going to play hard. They're going to go to the paint, and Gators is going to do Gator, in my opinion. True. So Starting for the Bandits, we have Braylon. We have Alfonso, we have Noah, we have... Yeah, I think that's JC. JC. And uh, Chief. And Chief. Yeah. Chief is pretty, pretty athletic guy. He was dunking a little bit in the warm-up. Uh, for the Gators, we got Braylon over to Chief. Yeah, the Gators got a Chilly, interesting Gator. lineup. Joel, Joel's a big boy. Joel, I've heard a lot about Joel, so he's we'll see a, about that. He's a big boy. And three off the rim. See, they're gonna go with the Gator from the game plan. Took that three. Oh, Gator, Gator with the ball, covered by Alfonso. Oh, Chief good. with the steal over to Alfonso. Defense. Nice finish, defense. and that is the Bandit way. That is defense, 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 and defense. Nice start to the game for both teams. Good opportunities. Hey. Good job by Ghost. Nice. Good take. I've heard Ghost may be most improved. Yeah, heard Ghost. a few things about that. That's a beautiful finish right there. Great Ghost job by Ghost. Great pickup player, but last season he didn't show up in the game. So let's hope and see if he's going to actually play well this season. Gator with the ball. Gator kind of running point. Braylon tried to steal, didn't get it. Over to Ghost in the corner. No three. Oh. Up top. Boone with the shot, with the miss. Oh, Pushing good. face, Braylon really? down. Nice finish. finish by Braylon. Bandits have had a great start so far. Let's keep track of the scoreboard. A little score issue earlier. Let's, let's keep track yeah, of the scoring. Oh, Gator! Gator. Bang. Gator wow. is awake and roaring. Gator doing nice Gator start. asking for the call as well. That was a big shot right there for the Gators. JC. Wow. Big shot by Gator. Sean bringing the ball up the court. Down That's low. Joel. Joel. Oh. Doesn't get it. Braylon pops it out to Alfonso. Stolen by Ghost. Oh. Down low to Chile. Oh! Oh! oh. 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 That would have been our dish of the day. Man. Man, that was beautiful. That was very nice. Nice steal very by right. Ghost. This is bandit basketball right now. Just yeah. hectic. Ball going around yeah. everywhere. Nice finish by Chile down low. But we got to see they're going to capitalize their opportunities. They had a couple turnovers off of those steals they had. That's Chief with the ball. Over to Braylon. Braylon with the shot. Nice oh, finish by Braylon. Yeah, very, very talented kid. Let's see if his mind is right this whole season. What are your can, thoughts on that? He, I, think, I think this season, if he's motivated and wants to be the best player on the floor, he can play like the best player on the floor. But it's all mental with him. He's going to actually want to play like the best player. Yeah. But, nice finish by Boogie. I like Boogie. That's a fun name. Yeah. He, and Braylon, hopefully, uh, hopefully he wants to play. You, yeah. I mean, you know him. We, yeah. We, we did the same thing about Johnny last season. So let's see actually if he's going to show up and play hard every game. Um, but Boogie, he, he was actually wearing pajamas at all the um, – this is my first time seeing him with shorts on. He was wearing pajamas at all the pickups. Really? Yeah. All pajama so, pants. So I was like, interesting. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't get the finish, but it is a foul. Braylon will be shooting too. Pajamas playing pickup is an interesting, interesting situation. Yeah, so, it, I, I thought it would be too hot for him, but hey, it, that's how he goes. Braylon makes the first one. One more coming up. 
very close, tight knit game. I think it's mainly right now they're playing uh, bandit basketball, but they're just not capitalizing their opportunities right now. Uh, yeah, Gators, they played good defense, but the Gators just kind of roared a little bit. Yeah, Gators are just going for the paint. That, that should be the game plan the whole time. Just attack, attack, paint the whole time. They have probably two of the biggest guys in the whole league. Ooh. Got a foul call on JC. Two free throws. No? No, I think it's on the floor. Okay. We're good there. A lot of action oh, down low. Defense. Alfonso oh, bringing it up. Oh, oh good block by Ghost. Wow. Ghost with the hustle. rejection. Oh, Gator good back. Oh, oh, good stolen. Steal. Yeah, that's bandit basketball there. That little crazy, crazy all around the place. Crazy hectic. That's Slim Delirium basketball right there. Yeah. Slim, Slim with good the shot. Ghost, Ghost again. He's Ghost was out of bounds. Nick. Ghost is playing hard. I'm, I'm actually very happy for yeah, him. Yeah, he was a starter, right? No, yeah. no subs yet. Yeah. That's a good start. Braylon hurt his ankle. Ooh, that'll be a big loss for the Bandits if he has to get out. But Mike Mitchell, he, he played well in the scrimmages. So let's see if he's going to um, show up coming off the bench. Oh, Slim. Ooh. Yeah, it's, a, it's an interesting development there with Braylon injured. Nice drive by Gator in the finish. Hopefully, hopefully he's all right. That's a big loss for the Bandits if he can't come back. Yeah, that's a, that's a big deal. You got Chief with the ball up top over to Mike Mitchell. 4-3. 4-3, off the rim. No rebound, Gator's ball. Little Lewis Mexico. out of the game. We have a Little Mexico. Little Mexico, John. A little Mexico is in the game. He, he played very well in the scrimmages as well, so I'm very excited to see how he's going to do an actual game setting with jerseys on. Gator for three. Bang! Oh, Gator. Gator. On fire. Gator doing Gator things, man. We got a foul call there. Gator's just doing Gator things, just playing hard, getting his shots up. He, he might go for most improved as well because he was the fourth or fourth option for the blue team last season. Yeah. And he's now the first option, so his scoring is going to go way up. So far, he's been the first option over Chile. Yeah, so let's see if he can keep this up. It's a, it's a long game ahead of us, still seven minutes into the game right now. You got Zay. Is that Zay coming in for uh, Bandits? Uh, Up top? Uh, right here? 53? I think so. Or 59. Yeah. Oh, Chili. Number yeah. one overall pick. I don't think he scored yet. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe once. But yeah, it's been the Gators show for the Gators. And Ghost has been a part of the show. Oh, too. good pass to Gator. Gator Come on, Gator. Oh. Off the rim. Mike Mitchell, nice rebound. Beats the double team. And off problem on. Problem child. That's his nickname, Problem Child. Yeah, it's a nice nickname. I like that. Yeah, it's fun. He's a problem. Little little Mexico on the inbound. Over to Ziggy. Ziggy's probably the best shooter on the floor, but his problem is he doesn't like taking shots when he's open. No good on the three attempt. Chili, nice rebound down low. Over to Ghost. Gotta feed the big man. Over to Joel. Travel. Yeah, yeah that's travel. a good call. This is the first travel I think all day. I don't yeah. think there was any travel in your game. Yeah, it's I don't think there was a, a travel. It was very close a couple times, but I'm glad they called that's one. Back that's backcourt back right court. there. That's backcourt. The problem with this court is it's half of a court, so that line messes up people because they don't see the line. So they're just playing, just playing basketball, and they just don't realize they're going backcourt. I don't think we, we uh, called that last year as much. Great yeah. inbound to Ghost down low. We got a foul call. Yeah, but there's a lot of newcomers this season, so they just got to get used to it. Yep, I absolutely. felt like last season, in the beginning, there was a couple of calls of backcourt, but if we keep going with the season, I think they'll get used to the court. Yeah, they'll be fine. Shooting. But Ghost has been surprising me today. He's been very great. Well. Most improved player of the year so far. Yeah. Hood is in the game now. He's a big man. So far, Braylon has not returned from the injury. We'll see what he, happens. I hope he's all right. We might need Parker over there to check up on him, see the sideline report, to see if he's actually doing well. Little well, Mexico with the foul. We need a little background background information on what's going on. Hey, with Parker. Him. Parker. Their first round pick is injured. Do yeah, you have an update? You got an update on Braylon's ankle. Is he good? What happened? 
Oh, Braylon, Braylon looks like he's ankle. coming back in. He's coming back in, but, he, he's in, but he's he, hurt. He's hurt. he hurt his ankle. We should ask uh, Coach. Yeah, yeah ask he's their first Slim. round pick. Coach yeah, Coach Slim. Chili yeah. misses the Coach shot. Coach Slim of the Brown Brown Bandits will find out. <laughs> <laughs> the Brown Brown Bandits. <laughs> Ziggy's just doing Ziggy things. He was doing a little Ziggy move in the middle of the court. <laughs> How was Lake Nona yesterday? It was a great time. Great time. So sick. I live fun. in Lake Nona. It's a nice area, man. Yeah, I was over at the country club yesterday. Oh, that's... It's a beautiful area. Yeah. Though. Expensive drinks, but a good time. Yeah. And he makes the second one. I think that's Chili's first point. It may be. It's been the Gator, you know, Gator and it's Ghost. Been a, it's been a Gator show. Honestly. We got Ziggy over to uh, a new player. We got Hood. We got Chief down low. He's This guy right here, he's the one who crossed up um, Steve the Kid. <laughs> Gator off the. Oh, the oh, job. Line. Job crossed up yeah, Steve right the here. Kid. Mike Mitchell. And one. Nice finish and one. Beautiful play. And one. Big body. Problem. He, he's the problem the child throwing. He's a problem. It's a good, it's a good play. I hope Braylon's all right. That will be a big, big loss for them if he doesn't come back in the game. Yeah. Let's see what happens. We got Mike Mitchell shooting one. Chan, choo-choo trains in the game. We got the choo-choo. Probably my favorite nickname. And our brick of the day brought to you by Homegirls Real Estate. Looking to take the stress of home buying? Julian and Monique are here to help. Call 321-443-0005 to get things started. Brick of the day. Yeah, Choo Choo Train is probably my favorite nickname you ever gave anybody. Hey, bang! Nice job by Job, as Ant calls him, Cobb Salad. Beautiful, beautiful shot there. Yeah, Choo Choo Train will be interesting. Where's, you know, the, where's the origin of the choo-choo train? Nickname? I just like the way he was running up the court. Hey. Could have said he was a gazelle. It looked like a choo-choo train. Bang! Little hey. Mexico! John! I like it. He's, nice He's playing job. very well. He's, he's surprising me as well. Yeah, that was beautiful. Oh. We got the Jay Crid up top. Nice touch and finish. What a guy off the bench for them. How about that? The Took Gators? out. Joel, it took out the whole starting lineup to put him Gators in. Gators even on the bench. Gators might have the most depth in history if that's just if it's going to happen. Yeah. Nice spin by Alfonso. Nice finish. Beautiful. That's a crafty player brought to you by Mojo Depot. Alfonso is um, Tyreek's brother nice. on the Reapers. So we got a little brother brother connection they in this elimination. Yeah, they got some pretty good talent there. I like it. Mike Mitchell for three off the rim. Awesome. Mike Mitchell somehow got the ball back. Over to Hood. A little Mexico drive. Ooh, you gotta knock that down. Gotta knock that down. And off oh. the rim. Nice effort there by JC. Doesn't get it to fall. Job has the ball up top. Drive. Floater doesn't have the touch that time. He is triple teamed. Come on, Chan. Ooh, good pass. Chan. One more. Shot. Oh, over there. Foddy's in the game now. Oh, travel. That was a travel, I believe, right? Oh, they called a foul. Ooh. Called a foul after he did a little hop, skip, and a jump. But no worries I, there. I thought, it was, I thought it was a travel before the foul, but it's not a bad call. He did get fouled. I agree. Who's the, who's the guy inbounding the ball there for the Gators? I actually don't know. He never showed up to anything just yet. Um, let me see the back of the jersey. Yeah. Essentially, John yeah. Santos. 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 John. Yeah. Welcome to the game, John Santos of the Gators. Little Mexico coming up the court, guarded by Big Red. Choo choo. Ooh, oh, pass. nice pass. Little Mexico's got some game. Hey, Over to JC. Drive. And one. Nice finish. Beautiful. There was no foul call there. Nick's been a very uh, very quiet official. It's very, good. Very lenient ref. Yeah. I like it, though. Ooh, oh, that's an unfortunate backdoor violation. Subbing by the Bandits. Braylon is back in the game. Back in the game. Let's see how he's doing. So is Zay. I believe Zay, right? Yep. Braylon Zay in chief. Little Mexico. Is Lynn Delirium coming back? I don't think so. He might be coaching the rest of this half. We'll see. Yeah, he, he's not in the game yet. They are missing Sean. Sean has not a, showed up for the Bandits. But everyone else is here. Oh, that's a unfortunate situation there. And nice finish. By what a performance by Job. Yeah, he is playing very well. I mean, the touch around the rim, the steals, the defense. Great job. He's got a nice handle Zay too. Off the rim, man. John Santos with the Big rebound there. Rebound. Bringing up the court. Oh. Little Mexico, nice defense there, covering. Oh, that's a bad trap. Oh, off they, the rim. 
They didn't pay. No. <laughs> they didn't pay for the gamble. Zay over to Alfonso. Oh, he got oh, that Alfonso. man. Boogie Big with miss. the ball, Boogie with the ball, drive. Hey, nice yeah. finish by Boogie, great job. Time out, time out, yeah, time out, nine point game. What do you think of the game so far, Brandon? I think the injury to Braylon's the biggest the biggest deal. He's really hurt and he's not going to be able to play. You know, health and safety is number one. Talk to CJ since we ended that game. Good. What's up, brother? How are you? Good to see you. Now tell me what was going through your head when you absolutely obliterated somebody at the rim. Uh, business as usual. Business as usual. Come here, take care. We didn't get the win this time, but right. hey, look out for it. Lock up. Hey, I got you. Hey, I wouldn't pick against you. These guys, see you. These guys can't dribble, all right? So put pressure on them, all right? Put pressure on them. Slow the pace down on offense. We got to be cutting. We got to be cutting. Hey, let's cut to the basket. I get some ball move. Let's go. Bandits on three. One, two, three. Bandits. Let's go. Brown, brown. Gator, Gator, Gator. You guys are up right now. Nobody wanted to call a timeout for the first 14 minutes, so I had nothing to do. Um, what, Sorry about what, what, that. Yeah, what did you talk about with your team right there? With my team, I, I wanted us to keep up the high intensity, the big-time plays we've been doing. If anything, we're beating them on the court because of the amount of energy we're giving out. Absolutely. All right. Good luck to you the rest of the half. Interesting start, but as we saw last game, no lead is safe in this no league. No lead is safe at all. We got Chief inbounding to Alfonso. Alfonso with the ball up top. Big Red with the Big steal. Red. Look at that hustle. Ooh, Big Red That's going into the... Big them. Red, yeah, into the Big Blue Monster. Oh, my goodness. We have a little shaking bake moving on over there. Big Red versus Ooh. the Big Blue Monster. I want to see that fight. <laughs> yeah. Big Red won that one. I will get Big Red on that as well. We got Chief over to Braylon. Braylon's still in the game. Three seconds. Yeah. Offensive three seconds. Oh no, defensive, defensive three seconds by job, I believe, if he's still in there. Yeah, these are a lot of new guys. They're not used to playing with the defensive three seconds, so they gotta get used to not playing with their feet inside the paint on the defensive end. Yeah, that ankle is really bothering Bailey. Yeah, I think you gotta bring him out. I think, I think he's gonna fight through it though. We got four players. We got five, just kidding. Good pass. Ah, Slim. Slim tries for the shot, doesn't get the finish. Boogie with the ball. I'm Boogie and Chan coming up the court. What a beautiful Ooh. sight. Great, great, That's a steal. Uh, great team. That's bandit basketball Slim right there. With the steal, nice job. Braylon. What's up? You good now? Alright, see you, Luke. Good finish by Slim. We got a uh, job. Let's see if Java still has that little touch. The nice touch he had earlier on in the day. He's got a decent shot. handle as well. Yeah, ooh. Man, he's trying to follow up. And ooh, oh, with the man. left hand. That is God. tough. That's Crafty Player of the Day brought to you by Mojo Depot. Juliana Monique can bring you designs to life. Contact Mojo Depot today. Beautiful job by Job. He's crafty as can be. I love it. He might be sixth man of the year by the way he's playing. He's Zay dish out to Alfonso for three off the rim. Good rebound. Braylon with the drive and no touch. He got the touch, it's no good. The rims. Ever since the ball controversy in the first game, you guys said it was too bouncy. We changed it and nothing has fallen. Nothing. Yeah, maybe the bouncy ball let things fall in. It was making things fall in. It's uh it's interesting. Interesting development. I'm not a big science guy. I don't know much about air pressure, but I think it's changed a lot of things. I believe so as well. Braylon shooting two. Two one more. Makes the first one. Yeah, the Bandits, they, they, they're playing good defense. They just got to finish their opportunities around the rim. They missed a lot of layups yeah. this game. Braylon makes the second one as well. Nice job there. The Gators, to me, the bench is what's carrying this team. The job, body. It's a seven point game. Right. But they haven't lost anything with the starters being out. Yeah. If anything, they've been better. That's what, that's what I'm thinking as well. That was a bad miss there by right. Ghost. But. Like Gator, Chili, and Joel, the top three picks, yeah. haven't been in the game since like the 12 minute mark. Yeah, I know. They're taking a nice rest. Alfonso going up. Ghost trying to guard him. Nice play by Alfonso. I like that. Yeah, he's a very tough, tough, nail-gritted guy. Like, he's a little, bandit. A little push-off, but no call. It's good. Five-point game. Five-point game. 
Dom drives, gets held. I don't know if that could be a shooting foul, but it may be. We will see what happens. It's on the floor. I think on the floor. Call I like it. Floor. It's a good, it's a good call. On the floor. Well, there's Gator. The Gator siding. Joel's back in the game. They had a big long rest. Let's see if they finished the half strong. Yeah, they had a nice little slumber there, like a hibernation. Yeah. The gators were under the water for a little while there. Just, they're just, just stalking chilling. their prey. They're stalking their prey. Yeah, now they're ready. Oh. This is the first one. One more to go. It is the two minute warning. We will stop the clock after two. Two and under, he makes the second one. Two six minutes to go, game. six point game, yeah. Let's uh, see what happens. They need a big run to finish the half, the Bandits. Yeah. But the Gators been hibernating though since the 12 minute mark, so it'll be tough for them to finish the half strong. Braylon's healthy and they can run that offense through him. I think we got a good chance. Big Braylon three. for three, Ooh. off good the rim. Hustle. Oh boy. Woo! Oh, he's got to be on your toes, Boogie, with a nice little whoop. He oh. really doesn't get it all, man. Joel with the big board. Nice. He's a big boy, man. And one. He is tough to stop if you don't put a body on him in early. He's yeah, a Joel big boy. Joel is big. I've heard a lot about him. First time seeing him play, I like what I see. Joel's looking good. The yeah, problem with him is running up and down. How long can he last in a 20-minute half in a close game? You got a good rest there for a little yeah. bit. so. I think that's Gator's game plan. Give yep. him a little rest. And and finishing, oh my god, big board again. Boogie, nice rebound. Gator. What's up, Dom? Oh, you guys. <laughs> MVP <laughs> signing, MVP <laughs> signing. That's a, that's a bandit ball, eight point game. 90 seconds to go in the half. MVP signing right there, Dom. Yeah, man, he can go off. That next game is going to be interesting. Yeah, you're you're refing, I think. Yes, I am. You got to watch out because it can get hostile with oh, those two. I already, I'm already mentally preparing myself right now as we speak because it's going to be a lot of talk, talking trash. It's just a rivalry, man. Yeah, oh, yeah. We got a foul call yeah, that's a on Chile. Yeah, that's a good call. Oh, Gators, Gators talking. Inbound to Mike Mitchell. Mike Mitchell up top. Joel on him. Out of the paint. Off the rim. Braylon, no foul. We got the foul. Call. Call foul. And this might be the first tech of the game. Watch this. Watch this. Let's pay attention. There's been thought that Gator would get the first tech of the game. Gator, uh, and, Gator and Ant have a rivalry of sorts. Yep. I was about to say that it's been a very calm first half. I thought, I thought the last game there was a couple of close calls for technicals as well. It was a ball throwing that almost yeah. hit the roof. It did hit the roof, actually. I think it did. It wasn't called. So. Yeah, Vaughn, Vaughn, motion to oh, Man, the Reapers are, are not the Reapers, sorry. Bandits are uh, banditing bandits. themselves. Yeah, Bandits are just, I think right now is their first game. They have never played with each other. Yeah. The scrimmages, no one has really showed up for the Bandits. So. And the Gators, almost everybody showed up for the scrimmages. I feel like people showing up to the scrimmages and playing with each other before well, the season is a big, big factor in these games. About your team, everybody's like, oh, the scrimmages, Loft Millie didn't look good. Well, you look great today. So. Yeah, it, it was, I think it's a benefit of guys just showing up and getting willing to play with each other before the season. Knowing the teams, you know, meeting your players. Xander exactly. makes the first free throw, one more to go. Knowing each other's spots, where they like playing on the floor. I think it's a big factor right now in these first games in the season. I agree. We'll see it in the next game. Um, blue team, almost everybody showed up to all the scrimmages and everything. And red team, I mean, they got a lot of veterans, but I don't know if they've ever played with each other before. No, I agree. Gator misses the second. Go out with a rebound. And another foul call. Rebounding, man. Rebounding, rebounding, rebounding. I think that was Gator's tactic of getting the two biggest guys in the league. He was smart. He, uh, he's got a very balanced team. You know, yeah. It's it's, it's, it's shocking me right now. I didn't know Joel was jo this big. If I knew he was this big, I would have I would have made a different call in my uh, prediction. <laughs> yeah, Joel was uh, unknown during the draft. We kept hearing these things about, oh, he could ball, he should be good. Yeah. He's a quality player. Yeah, he, he might be an early second, late first next year by how I'd, big I'd he is. I'd compare Joel to Damian about how we didn't know much about him. But they and surprised then he you. became a freaking all-star. Yeah, 
Okay. Mike Mitchell with the ball. Drive. Down low. Quadruple team. Chili with the block. Uh, Chili with the rebound of the no shot. Chili drive. Oh. Over to Gator. That's out of bounds. Yeah, Chili just got slowed down a little bit. Maybe do a jump stop to the pass. He's a little bit out of control. Yeah. Well, the Bandits have done that quite a few times so far today, so. Yeah. It's it's been tough with the bandits, man. Yeah, it's, it's chemistry really, issues right now. Yeah, little Mexico with the shot That's off the side. Oh, Gator, Gator. drive Gator. gets the whole team. Oh, Gator, Over to Chile. we got a foul call, I believe. Thirty seconds to go. Yeah, this half's been very up and down, but the Gators are finishing the half strong. Yeah, it's been an interesting, interesting half. Chili misses the first. Chili, I don't know. Chili's good. I, I just need to see more out of Chili. I haven't seen him in a very long time. I know yeah. he's a talented player. I'm just. I think he's just playing his role right now, which I'm actually very happy for. He, he's rebounding, playing good defense. He's not really worried about scoring. Yeah. Like, he's guarding the best player right now very well. Yeah, I think Braylon's leg is hurting him a little bit. Let's we'll see what happens. But Chili versus Braylon is an interesting matchup. A lot of fun to watch. Braylon's really still good on defense there. Oh, good pass. Gator. Gator in the corner. Gator. Drive. No finish. Gator with the rebound. Joel, well, it, no finish. Joel, this is the, that's Gator basketball right there, man. The, the, the Gators, their, their whole Five, thing is paint two, touches. one. Chief off the rim. Yeah, the Gators are just killing with the rebound. And that is the end of the first half. Now here's a word from our sponsors. Thinking about buying, selling, or investing in real estate, the home girls got your back. Whether you're a first time home buyer or experienced investor, their team has the resources, knowledge, passion, and experience to guide you and your family through any real estate journey. Their top priority is to take the stress away from your home buying and selling experience. Call Juliana and Monique today to get started at 321-443-0005 or Instagram at FL Homegirls, Facebook, Real Estate Mojo. Downtown Diner is located in the heart of Celebration, Florida with a beautiful lakefront view. Their menu puts a modern touch on the classic diner feel. From pancake bacon dippers and French toast fries to chicken and waffles and Monte Cristos, they have something for everyone. They are now open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. on weekends, offering an exclusive dinner menu with specials changing weekly. On top of that, they are currently offering a student happy hour from Monday to Thursday, 3 to 5 p.m. throughout February. Make sure to get on down to the Downtown Diner and follow their Facebook page to stay up. Everybody feeling? Good. 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 That's what I thought you were gonna say. Good work. Keep it up, Green Green Gators. <laughs> green Green Gators, go. Good. We gotta find bodies. That's all we're looking for bodies. Looking for bodies. We're go catch some bodies out man there, is boys. For bodies. Yes, for man is looking for bodies. bodies. This man is athlete. Good work. That that got us nowhere. I mean, I learned a whole bunch. <laughs> what I learned is Green Team's feeling good. Brown's looking for bodies. They're fucking bandits. They're fucking crandits. They're fucking, I don't know. Steve the Kid. Hey man, I just, you know, Sully Nation, day one, season one, you feel me? Well, season. <laughs> no, this is season like. <laughs> Who season 100. Season two of the, the expansion. <laughs> we have me? expansion teams, you're on one of them. The yeah. Purple Purple Reapers. Yeah. Oh, and then yeah. we got the Brown Brown Bandits, the Green Green Gators, Wolf the Pack. Blue Blue Wolf Packs, and the Pink Pink Heartbreak Kids, and the, the Gold Gold La Familias. You know, some of them are easier to pronounce than others. Yeah, so. yeah. Come on. I like the inspo, though. I like the inspo. I like your inspo. I like this, man. Hey, hey let's talk about hey, some fit, can man. can I tell you? Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm done. Hello, everyone. We are back for the second half of the Brown Bandits and the Green Gators. Mike Mitchell with the drive, with the shot, and a touch. It goes in. Nice start for That's the Bandits. Good start. They, they need a couple stops right now, man. A couple nice stops. Stop to the Bandits. We got Chili with the ball bringing it up. Chili over to Gator. Gator had a good first half. But he's Gator with the spin with the whoop de whoop. Oh, turnover. Ghost with the sh nice job by Ghost down. Good pass. Over to Joel. A little, a little crazy. Gator. JC with the ball coming up the court. Chief, Fonzo, 
Braylon has good ball movement. Off the rim, off the rim. Gator. Oh, oh stolen by Mike Mitchell. Gator Bandit wants a basketball. foul call. No foul call. Oh, and we got a foul. No foul. It's a good start for the Bandits. They, they just need to finish their opportunities. AJ, we, AJ, we can't see. We, I love you though, but I can't, I can't see. Franchise is uh, the referee of the game. It is the He's totally love duo of Ant and Mike Kerr. Celebrity, celebrity ref. He took a celebrity shot and now he's refing. That's interesting. So we're good to go. Mike Mitchell misses it. Yeah, that's been the whole game. The Bandits, the Bandits are playing good. They just need to finish their opportunities around the rim and just offensive possessions. I felt like their defense was pretty good. Yeah, absolutely. Braylon said he's playing through pain, so we'll see yeah, how he Yeah, he was goes. asked, if is he good? And the answer was no. Not a good sign. He's playing through pain. Well, like I said, Mahomes played through pain and they won the game. So we'll see what happens. Chief, down to Braylon. We have a whistle in the backboard. It's a foul? The referees don't really tell us much, just a heads up. So uh, we will never know. We will never know. I don't even know what the call was, but it, it is Gator basketball. It's interesting. Oh, post up. Joel down low. That, nice. He's a problem. He's a problem, man. That's a big boy. Big 22, Joel. Down to Alfonso. Alfonso guarded by Gator. Alfonso drives, did a little hop skip, and... Oh, Chili was going to die for that, but he saw somebody in the crowd, and he backed off. It was a great job by Chili. Safety first of our nice spectators. Nice try, and we got... JC with the ball, bringing it up for the Bandits. Over oh. to Alfonso. The chemistry with the Bandits, they need that to practice, been, I think. They need to practice. Yeah, they, they just need to play together, some pick up, something, because you can tell the chemistry is off. And Joel down low oh again. Goodness, and he is killing. Beautiful job by Joel. That's he a nice is, dish of the day brought to you by Downtown Diner. He, he might be going for Rookie of the Year, by the way, he's playing three, right now. Three. Bang! We have a whistle. And it might be an and four. I mean, and one. And one with the four point play. Nice big, job. Big shot. Not enough. Not enough. Not enough. Thank you. And, uh, Not a lot of bangs in this game. Yeah, he's awesome. I like him. He's a good kid. Nick is, Nick is showing off. He's, he's a big asset for Cellar Nation. And he got the fourth point. That's important. Ten point game. Chili Plenty of time left. Chili bringing the ball up the court, guarded by the whole team of Bandits. The pass. Joel. Joel down low. Oh my goodness. Oh Unstoppable. my goodness. Joel. Joel. The adjustment of the day brought to you by Winter Park Chiropractor is Joel getting the ball every time. Joel. How about that? Joel might just be player of the game, man. He, he is making a huge difference in this game just with his size and his body. He's been awesome. Look out for the brick of the day. We need a brick of the day brought to you by Homegirls Real Estate. If you see a bad brick, let me know. You will. This, this free throw might be the brick of the day right here. We had one earlier, I think. It didn't touch air, it didn't touch net, it didn't touch rim, it didn't touch anything. We'll see he, what happens. He's not the best free throw shooter, so we'll see if this might be it. That there was it is. okay. That was, wasn't terrible, but we'll keep it in our mind. That might be brick of the day. Chief. Brought to you by Home Bills Real Estate. Chief with the ball over to oh, Slim. Joel just up. everywhere. Joel is just playing. So hard right now. Very, very hard. Chili, drive, chili, up. Oh, oh no. Joel is looking like the best player on the floor right now. He is. JC over to Braylon. Braylon for three. Off the rim. Nice rebound by JC. Off the rim as well. Not much defense or offensive rebounding opportunity down there, but that's okay. Chili with the ball. Chili guarded by Braylon again. I don't know who Gator. has the ball. Gator for three! Gator. Gator just doing Gator things, man. Go Mexico! Go oh, Mexico with the ball, one of my favorite oh, players. Good pass. Slim one over more. to JC. JC uh, could do Braylon game if he wants, or he could get his own shot. A little Mexico with the ball. Uh, it's, Gator's uh, tough, tough. No chemistry right now is killing the Bandits right now. Chili, nice movement there, but they couldn't finish. Gator with the ball, Gator up, and out. Rough the job yeah. there, foul. Yeah. Wow, Their that was size. strong, strong finish, yeah. Gator's size is making a huge impact in this game. Just 
with Chili and Joel and Chan, the Choo Choo Train and Gator. Choo Choo! It's just, they, they just made an impact with their size, and I feel like they're tiring down the bandits. Yeah, I agree. Chili for the end one. There it makes is. it. Yeah, time out. out. Yeah, time big, out, good banditos. Time Brandon with the bum ankle isn't helping, but the size I think is just wearing and tearing down the bandits. Joel's been, been having an amazing game. I wouldn't be surprised he had like 20 points and like 12 rebounds. So uh, what, do, what do the bandits need to do to win this game? They need to speed this game up. They need to speed this game up, pass the ball around, look for the best shot. I feel like right now the bandits are just looking to score points and get on the stat sheet instead of playing with each other. Um, I think that's the biggest thing and just chemistry. It looks you can tell they just haven't played with each other at all. The Gators, you can just tell they're they're just playing together. They're playing as a team and they're moving the ball and looking for the best shot. And Gator just doing Gator. He's the wild card of the team. He might give you 21 game and the next game he might give you eight to ten. But his team is very very loaded. Yeah, it's been a very even uh, even output. Green is just playing hard. They're hustling. They're looking good. Fadi the body, how you feeling? Come here. How are you, you sick bastard? I'm feeling good, living great. high as fuck? I'm feeling good, living great. Right. Good, good. <laughs> they got some, green team's got some big bastards on their team. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> These are some well-fed gators. These are some big boys. <laughs> These are some big boys. He doesn't like it, that's what Chili said. I love it too, Chill. Chill, number one pick, how you feeling out there? Feeling good, bro. I just saw that and one that was very tough. You know, if I'm open, I'll miss it. But no, if I but get that contact, that's it's an M1. You, you like it a little bit harder than it has can't to stop be. Me. Yeah. Can't stop my man. But the best part, we're playing as a team, bro. Yeah, playing you guys defense, are playing team basketball. Moving the ball, the right idea, we're going to get better, bro. Hey, I wouldn't want to play against you guys. Let's get it. Bro. Hey, good shit. Love you. I, I fuck it. He's such a good dude. <laughs> well, you know what? You gotta love chili. You can't love chili. You love it on noodles. You love it by itself, you love it with cheese, you love it with hot sauce. Chili is chili. Chili Cancella. Number one pick for a reason. Oh, yeah, it's good. No, no, it's okay. cool. yeah, Monique is not here for the Gators. I was trying to get him a text, but like, you got the text. Yeah, she, yeah. I mean, Batman just slipped in in the halftime like, like he is. He's, he's the Batman. It's our night. <laughs> he's the, he, just, he just comes in through the shadows, man. He, I didn't even know he came. He just showed up. He said, I'm ready. I was like, well, he came at halftime, man. He did. He popped up out of nowhere. It was an interesting development. We got a free throw for Zay. He's 0 for Perez. 3. That's a little Mexico. Nice awareness there. Free throws are key throws. They need to make them. Whoa. Joel is just Joel. making an impact out there. Three. Boogie for three. Oh. Bang! The bank is open on Sundays. Oh Boogie my man. goodness. What a shot. I don't think he called bank, but I guess it's open on Sundays. That was beautiful. Braylon's trying to get it. Nice, gets the ball. He can't do it by himself, man. He, it needs to be a team effort. Yep. You need to figure it out. Boogie for three. Oh. Off the rim. Wouldn't that have been amazing? Chan, it big red with the rebound. Come on, Chan. Good. Ooh. Ooh, a little too hot. A little too hot. He fired that like a train. He fired that like, like he was going 100 miles an hour. It was still a very good pass. It just, you know, a little lighter. See, look at that. Chili's talking from the bench. I love it. It's like they have two captains. Yeah, Chili's a good leader. Gator's a good leader, but Chili's and very one. vocal. Nice yeah. drive. Yeah, he's trying to do it by himself right now. Well, I mean, offensively, it's pretty, it's pretty much been him. Yeah. Alfonso's had some moments. Uh, Zay has as well, but the free throws have been really tough. No, uh, they missed a no lot free of free throws, throws this yeah. game. They missed a lot of open layups, a lot of turnovers. It's just the recipe for not winning the game. He makes the first one. There's still a lot of time left in this game. Scoreboard is a very, uh, it's very scary thing. I, yeah. I don't. Uh, yeah, I we got to. We, right. we have to pay attention to I that. I appreciate everybody volunteering, but. If you volunteer, if you volunteer, I know it's a tough job, you always gotta pay attention, but you just always yeah. always gotta be ready. You can make an impact to, to a game if it's a close game. Scoreboard is very important. He makes the second one. Nice job by Braylon. Free so, throws are important. There's still 11 minutes left in this oh, game. They can still left. come back. It's just right now they just gotta figure it out on the fly and get some stops. 
John Santos with the ball. There it is. Oh, the ball came our way. Good catch by Coach Toen there. Hey, Looking always, alive. Always ready. Always ready, Brandon. I was, I was thinking to shoot it right there, too. <laughs> Foddy with the Foddy. ball. Nice try. No That's foul, great but great take. finish. Great take by Foddy. Foddy the body. Using his body like his nickname. Woo! Well, that would have been nice if he fell over. Come on, Ziggy. I need Ziggy something. Ziggy with the ball over to Hood. Hood drive. And what? And I mean, these two free shots. Throws. Two shots. That's a tough thing about running clock is the free throws usually would be beneficial because it stops the clock and you get points up. Yep. But because it's a running clock. They're not free points anymore. It's not yeah. free points. It's... I would rather just get a layup and keep it moving than these free throws because it, it wasted 30, 30 seconds already. Absolutely, I agree. First one planted through. Made the first one. There's not much. Uh... It's not not a lot of like talking trash or anything out there. It's just a clean game of basketball right now. Yeah. Bandits need to get into another gear. Yeah, they, they kind of push a little more because they're they, not pushing. They need to yeah, push. they're, they're trying to. It's just the Gators are just playing Gator basketball, slowing down the ball, moving the ball, and looking for the big guys inside. And that's bandit basketball. That's what they do. They but they got to finish the opportunities. They keep turning it over, too. Braylon for three. Off the yeah, rim. See, another turnover that led to no points. Good job with the ball. Job's been quiet since his outburst in the first half. John Sandoz with the ball. Could have trapped him if they wanted to. They don't. Job's got the ball back. Over to Foddy. Oh, good pass by Foddy right there. Foddy! Great vision by Foddy. Dish Foddy of the day Foddy. brought to you by Downtown Diner. Actually, also, sweet finish of the day brought to you by Ashes Bake Shop. It won! A lot of fouls, but they got to make their free throws. Foddy's also a chef. He works at Red Robin as a chef. Who does? Foddy. Really? Yeah, he's cooking up out there like he's doing at Red Robin. I like it. We have good fries. Yeah, he yeah he comes he comes to every scrimmage with a burger, but he just doesn't eat it. So we're, I'll we, eat it. Hey, I will eat it as well if he if he offered. I almost stepped on one. <laughs> he, I, don't, I got yelled at, but I'm like, why do you have it on the court, Foddy? Yeah, you can't, you can't do that. He, it's, a it, it's a delicacy, a burger. That's yeah. a, you and I both know those are delicious. Oh, amazing. Amazing. But made both free throws, that's big. What team is Ish on? Ish is on Heartbreak Kids. Okay. Yeah, they have a lot of depth, but yeah, a lot of ego. Foddy trying to cook it oh up. Oh my and goodness! Sweet Foddy. finish of the day brought to you by Ashes Bake Shop. How about that? Looking to satisfy your sweet tooth, Ashes Bake Shop takes home baking to a whole new level. This is Ashes Bake Shop to order today. How about that? Welcome to the game. Foddy, numero uno, with the play of the day. Foddy is cooking it up like he's doing at Red Robin, man. He is cooking it up. Yeah, we got everybody warming up for this next game. It's I'm very. Well, the next game will be interesting. Yeah. Uh, timing is always the, game the third right game is important, but we'll see what happens. Yeah, that's a break of the game right there by Foddy. Ooh. Got a foul call. It is a 19 point game. 19 point game. Yeah, they just can't. They, they just haven't made a run where they can come back in this game. It's been just free throws, slowing it down, a couple shots. They need to speed this game up, get a couple of quick shots, a couple of quick buckets, and just. Try to make a run out of it. I agree. That might help. But again, Foul another free throw. It's more free throws and more time just running out of the clock. Makes the first one, Mike Mitchell. The bench is, the, the starters are coming and back. And the Gators, yeah, this is they, the final stand, the last stand. Romans and the Emperors, yeah. you know, the big, big last stand. We'll see uh, if they can yeah, solidify the Gators, their lead. The Gators have been doing a good job in their rotation, man. They, everybody played a good amount of minutes. Yeah. The Gators hibernating. Now they're going to finish with, the, honestly, their best lineup right now. They're trying to finish strong. We'll see what happens. 
Maybe no running clock in the last two minutes. If it's a 20 point game, we'll see. Yeah, back to Joel. Been a quiet five minutes for him, but he's back. Yeah, he, he got a good rest. 17 point game. They can make it happen if the Bandits uh, you need threes, though. The they free just, throw game is not going to work for them. They yeah, don't have they, enough time yeah. to shoot 17 free throws. Yeah, they, they just don't have enough time, and if they get fouled, that's another 30 seconds to a minute going off the clock. Yeah, a little next to go for three. Oh, that would have been amazing if that hit. It does not hit, unfortunately, for Little Mexico. There's Ghost. Ghost the over to Gator. Gator on Slim, Slim on Gator. And Slim gets the ball. Nice effort by Little Mexico, I believe, was down low. Yeah, they're, they're, they're hard. playing hard. They just need to score some points. Mike Mitchell with the drive. Oh, good block by Joel. Braylon double team. Yeah, he, he should have shot that three right Breaks there. it. Gators. Yeah, it should be. It should be Bandit's ball. Nick had it from back here. Said Bandit's ball. Yeah, it should be Bandit's ball right now. Yeah, they nice hit this three. There. They don't get it to fall. Good hustle by the Bandits. They they gotta make quick shots. They're dribbling the. They're dribbling themselves out this game right now. Yeah, Brady That's a foul. Doesn't yeah. get the. Doesn't get the. Shot to drop, but three free, three throws. free throws. It is 425 once the foul occurs. Let's yeah. see what happens. It might, it it might could be, be a 14 point game, but. But it could be 230 remaining. Let's yeah, see. it might. It might go to three minutes left in the game from At these least. three free throws. Yeah. Oh, this is miss. the first one. I think the longer the season goes and the longer the Bandits play together, they will play better. It's oh, their first better. game. Yeah, they'll get better. It's their first game. They just got to figure each other out how to play with each other. That's how it is with the first game. Especially in Cellar Nation where it's a draft. We redraft every season. Most of these guys never play with each other. Yeah. So they just got to figure it out on the fly. And missing all missed three all three. free throws. And it took about a minute to do that, yeah. too. It's, it hurts. Yeah, that hurts with time, and this, now they're going to play Gator basketball. Job from downtown. Bang! From Man, deep. Is that nice. From deep. That's about like 28 to 30 feet right there. That was nice. Mike Mitchell with the ball. Joel guarding him, and he steals the ball. Great defense by Joel. Potentially a crafty player by brought to you by Mojo Depot. Oh. Oh, Fonzo hustling. Oh, nice spin there. They're dribbling themselves out this game. They got to make quick passes and quick ball movement and quick player movement. Miscommunications from the officials. They got a new crew. A little confusion there, but we got to sort it out. Job with the ball up top, guarded by Alfonso. Joel yeah. setting the screen, down low to Chili. Nice one. play. And one, and that may be it. Yeah, that's the I don't want to call dagger. it, but I think that may be it. That's the dagger Some more right scoreboard there. Scoreboard issues, but that's okay. Who cares? Yeah, 22 point game. Yeah, 22 point game is going to be running clock till the end. It is, right? Maybe? Yeah, I, I think it so. is. The Gators just showed up to play. They made a statement with the first game. Hey, and, and. Yeah, it's running clock. Yeah, they're running clock. Yeah, they're running clock. Yeah, they're running clock. I believe it is running clock. And another rebound, and another rebound by Joel. It's 20 points. Yeah, mercy rule. So. Yeah. Joel just had two offensive rebounds. He is making, he's just showing his presence out there. I mean, to me, he's player of the game because we don't know him. He's, he's player of the game just by the impact he made in the game. Him getting those rebounds and throwing his body around and tiring down the bandits. Like, I'm looking at the bench right now and they all look exhausted. Mike Mitchell with the drive. Oh, this might be a dunk. I need a dunk, Chili. Ghost. Oh. Like and another effort. rebound by Joel. Like, They're just too big down low. They, they are just killing They're them. They're too big down low. Their physicality, their connectivity is beautiful. Braylon the ball, Chili still guarding Braylon. Braylon over to JC. Uh, 
And a turnover. Yeah, man, it's... Crazy. crazy. Yeah, Joel, Joel just showed his impact the whole game. Man. Like Job, like Joel, we knew everybody else, but those two really stuck yeah. out. Great job, look at that. Job. He did it, it didn't work, but he still tried to sneak through that crack. Gator with the ball for three. three. Oh. Bang! And that is the finishing touch on a dominant Gator victory. Green Gators. Yeah, Gator. Gator came to play. Yeah, he's. I think he's going to dribble the ball out. A little upset. I, I think he's going to call the game. Yeah, that's game right there. Game over. Yeah, the Bandits, they just got to learn how to play with each other. That is game over. Play and we'll definitely. see you for the finale. What a win. What team basketball that was displayed out there. It really was I think it was. I think it was defense, hustle, hard work. You guys were playing for each other out there. Yeah. You got some big bodies on your team. Some Absolutely. big, big bodies. And it all started with the heart and hustle between myself, Chili, and Joel. Yeah, we absolutely. really put it in perspective what we really needed to do. Jordan put in some big time buckets as well as huge defense, especially against Braylon. Absolutely. And then of course, Yob coming in off the bench, really dropping buckets on them. You you started off so hot, just balling. I was so excited. Hitting threes, I, taking them to the hoop. How did that feel? It felt great. Yeah. My team was actually putting me in the position to succeed though. Oh, I was yeah. getting great off ball screens and it, it just felt easy to shoot out there, especially with the team moving like that. Absolutely. How do you build off of this win? Uh, we got to keep up the same work ethic. Keep up the just same because work. we win one doesn't mean the next game could be a toss-up. We got to keep hitting the heart and hustle. Defense is the main priority of our team. Good. If our shots aren't going, Lord knows we're going to play expert defense. Yeah, excellent That's defense, excellent defense. Floor is yours. Anything you want to say to Sally Nation? Welcome. Season two of the Expansion League. Um, six teams. How are you feeling about it? I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah, it's one of the OGs. Absolutely. Yeah. I've been there since day one, yeah. especially when I played on that red team in the first right. Selly, Selly Games Absolutely. back in 2013. Absolutely. Yeah, it just it feels good to be back out there in a captain position. Absolutely. As well as uh, the, the talent pool has drastically gone up. Oh, so man. I'm a. Uh, it's going to be tough out there, but Lord knows I love good competition. I love seeing you play against good competition because you are good competition. Get out of here. Love you. All good right. work.